Hello friends and social media people. So I'm here to do a product review. Well, in my case, a user review. Itel Mobile Philippines Vision 2 Plus. Ayan. So at I think ito yung pinakabago nilang phone that they released. Kasi nirelease to April 2021. So bagong bago. Fresh na fresh. So this is the launching live stream of Vision 2 Plus. Plus their first ever Shopee Mall live stream. Ayan. Ito po yung mga kaganapan mo siya. So, after that live stream, ayan, nirelease yung Vision 2 Plus, and then, I got my Vision 2 Plus. So, ito na siya. So, I've been using it for the past weeks. So, ayun nga, ikukwento ko kung ano yung experience ko with the phone. So, um, so hindi kasi ako nakapag-unbox. So, papakita ko na lang sa inyo guys kung ano yung mga kasama sa loob ng ITEL Mobile Vision 2 Plus na box. So, what I got is, uh, meron siyang kasama clear case, hard case. And then, charger. So, yung charger niya is USB. O, basta yun, o USB. And then, ito yung pinaka-favorite ko kasi ang tip ng earphones. Red and black. So, since nga ginagamit ko siya, medyo buhol-buhol. So, and yun lang nga, you'll get the idea, guys. What I got is the gradient blue. I heard that. <laughs> the gradient blue. So, ayan siya. But, it has three colors. Meron yung gradient green and gradient sea blue. Gradient blue. Tatlo po yung colors na. Na magpipilian nyo. And you can get this phone under 5,000 pesos only. So, I think the original price of uh, Vision 2 Plus is 4,999 if I'm not mistaken. And then, naka 500 off pa sila. So, you can get this phone for 4,500 or 4,499. So, naglalaro lang sa ganong price. Okay. So, it has a 6.8 inches display. So, rear camera niya is 13 megapixel and then yung front camera is 5 megapixel. Meron din siyang 5,000 milliampere. So, pwedeng-pwede mo siyang gamitin all day long with all your mobile phone stuff. <laughs> For 5,000 milliampere, 16 days standby with SIM card. So, diba? Kahit na standby lang siya, nag-aantay lang siya sa'yo. <laughs> Tapos, 36 hours calling. Ayan. So, pwede kayong mag-telebabad. Um, pagkagising mo, nakakonect pa rin siya. If yung kausap mo, nakakonect din. Kasi kung hindi siya 36 hours calling, so, mga madededbat siya eventually. Tapos, meron din tayong 84 hours music. So, pwede kang mag-music lang for 84 hours to, just to get the idea. And then, meron din 24 hours video watching. So, para dun sa mga kagaya ko na mahilig mag-Netflix, mag-binge watch ng mga series, manood sa YouTube, even yung pagbabrowse lang ng mga videos sa Facebook. Minsan, hindi mo alam. Two hours ka na palang nagbabrowse ng mga videos sa Facebook. And then, yung mga, mga pinapanood ng videos sa TikTok or pag gumagawa kayo ng videos for your TikTok. Pwede, pwede din siya. Okay, meron din siyang fingerprint. Ayan, dito sa likod. Ay, bumukas. Dito na nakakamay. Kasi nagsiselfie ako kami. Ulit-ulit. O, oh, mabilis. Mabilis naman yung kanyang ano, pag-open with the fingerprint. Tapos, tignan natin ito, face recognition. Mararecognize ba niya yung ating face? O. Oh, recognize. Siyempre naman. So, meron din siyang um, pin. Ayan, pwede nang lagay yung password mo dyan. And then, 4G na rin siya. Of course, balik tayo dun sa paggamit ko for the past weeks. So, I used it sa aking live stream work. So, ginamit ko siya for my Lazada live stream two times since I got it. Ito po ang um, paggamit ko sa kanya during my live stream. Ayan. I think photo yan. Ilalagay ko photo. Photo. 
Tapos, ito yung quick video of my live stream. Para makita ninyo kung ano yung nangyari ng live stream. Up. Okay, tapos na. <laughs> tapos, ito nga, ginamit ko din siya for mobile games. So, hindi naman ako magaling mag-mobile game. Mag-mobile games. So, ginamit ko siya specifically for ML. So, huwag na lang kung pansinin yung paglalaro. Basta ginamit ko siya sa ML. So, ito siya. Mabilis na. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Ginamit ko siya for ML. Hindi naman siya nag-lag. So, the only time that I experienced na nag-lag siya is nag-ML ako sa labas and nakadata ako. And, na ano ako, mahina pala yung data. Tapos, na-AFK ako. Tapos, twice ako na AFK, tapos medyo na-block ako maglaro for some time. Siguro yung mga na AFK dyan nakaka-relate. So, sad. But, it's not the phone, yung internet connection. So, anyway, yun na. Kasi na naman tayo napupunta. Budget phone under 5,000 pesos. Talaga namang ma-recommend ko siya for, I think, students. Or, if you just want something na hindi ganun kamahal, budget friendly na okay naman yung performance. So hindi ko pa pala napakita yung ating video and photo. So ginamit ko siyang video for one of my workout workout sets. So ito yung aking workout set using the camera. I think front cam yung ginamit ko dito if I'm not mistaken. Then next ko rin yung camera niya for photos. So ito yung photo. And selfie. Siyempre, hindi mawawala yung kailangan si selfie ko sa phone. So, ayun na nga, guys. So, if you are looking for a budget-friendly phone, under 5,000 pesos, I recommend this for you. You can use it for all your social media stuff. You can use it for Zoom meetings kasi mataas yung kanyang battery. So, you can do it for online class para sa mga students natin. Pwede-pwede mo rin gamitin for... Um, mobile games, kasi ako I tried and tested it for mobile games hindi naman siya nag-init and hindi naman siya naglalag as long as stable yung iyong connection. And then of course, I used it for YouTube uh, video watching sinelfie ko na rin ginamit ko na rin for live stream for work, so you can do it as an all around phone under 5,000 pesos. So I think it's a good buy for me if Um, on a budget tayo. And then you can also give it as a gift to your um, parents, lalo na ngayon, with the Father's Day. Pwede mo pwede siyang gift. If nag-uumpisa pa lang ang ating mga fathers dyan to be a little bit techy. Ayan. Kasi ako naman, guys, hindi naman ako, I'm not the techiest person that you meet. Pero, um, na-witness na, na ko yung evolution ng phone eh, from keypad to smartphone. So, I think naman eh, ay, may karapatan naman ako to give my opinion and I have my own fair share of mobile phone experiences. You could also follow all their social media pages. Ito po yan guys, Facebook, Instagram, and ang kanilang website. And also, they have an official flagship store sa Shopee and Lazada. Ayan. And then, mayroon din silang mga physical stores available nationwide. Thank you, thank you for watching. And I do hope that you are entertained and also you learn something sa mga pinagsasabi ko guys. So anyways, I'm Joanna and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!